It is the 3rd of the 9th, 2011. This is the climate change update. I got a lot to cover tonight, so we're going to be quick about it. Extinction protocol, fire forces 1500 in Southern California, home evacuations, a fast moving wildfire erupted Friday on the main interstate between Southern California and Las Vegas. So I'll be darned uh, heads up, they got fires out in your area. I'm saying over 500 acres in just two hours. The Kamachka um, Shilvich volcano eruption threatens international air traffic. Uh, once again, that volcano is ongoing, major eruption. Offshore mud volcano erupts in the Azov Sea in the Ukraine. And it's a, uh, yeah, just a great big hot mud volcano. Uh, they have a video, but I don't think it's of this event. Um, they think that video is from a 2008 mud volcano, but it's still pretty interesting to watch. Tropical Storm Lee, right on top of the BP oil spill. A leak, gusher, whatever you want to call it, may drop 20 inches of rain over parts of Louisiana. And uh, you got to remember, where is Lee picking up this moisture? What's all over the top of this uh, water? Scientists find major earthquake fault under Mount Hood. 6.7 earthquake shakes northern Argentine capital. In Buenos Aires got a big quake. Uh, some people evacuated buildings and it was felt hundreds of kilometers away. I don't say anything about any major loss of life or anything. Uh, Dow takes a 200 point tumble at Open Bell on weak job outlook. All according to plan and manipulation. <clears throat> Here's definitely one to take note of. What has happened to the sun? Solar wind speed drops to near 50 year low. Uh, the solar winds have fallen to a low speed, 280.3 kilometers per second. Uh, with a proton density event of uh, 0.9 protons. And the average solar wind speed is around 400 kilometers per second. And uh, space weather says this is uh, <clears throat> not usual at all. And uh, there's another story that's going to come up later about a, a big coil that's going on coming around right now that might have something to do with it. Uh, definitely the sun's something to keep an eye on right now if, if uh, the, the wind is down to record levels. Over to Earth changes. Big earthquake strikes Alaskan Island, triggers a tsunami warning. Magnitude 6.8 earthquake struck Alaska's Aleutian Islands in the wee hours of the morning, uh, prompting a tsunami warning in the Pacific Ocean that was then canceled about an hour later. It was originally reported as a 7.1. <clears throat> And on to the BP oil spill coming out of today. Uh, oil still gushing from the BP well in the Gulf, and that was the video I put out earlier. U.S. oil spill shuts Mobile, Alabama shipping channel. Mobile, Alabama, heavy petroleum spilled into the Mobile River early Thursday, forcing the closing of the shipping channel, Alabama authorities said. A tank ruptured at a private terminal on Blakely Island, Judith Adams of Alabama State Dock said. So we've got a major oil spill going on in Alabama. New evidence of massive oil slick near deep water horizon site. A psychopathic BP denies it exists. And this is ongoing, of course, uh, with the disaster that is the Gulf of Mexico. Over to the watchers, Tambora Volcano in the Mexico, uh, the one that was just south of Mexico City, is showing signs of reawakening. No, no, that's the one in Indonesia, my bad. Has been raised to level of two alert. Here's that story. An enormous filament of magnesium slithering over the sun's northeastern limb. Today's NASA Solar Dynamics Observatory is monitoring a uh, scene wave of 400,000 kilometers long. It's an enormous filament of magnetism slithering over the sun's northeastern limb. And I don't know if this is attached to the unusual... Uh, low wind speeds or not, but uh, again, the sun's definitely something to pay attention to right now. <clears throat> and over to Ice Age now, Catalyst signing, showing more signs of an eruption. Uh, 
Following the intense week of earthquakes and tremors, experts believe magma is slowly filling inside the Iceland's massive Katla volcano. Uh, 18 Indonesia volcanoes are on alert status as of right now. And of course the volcano near Mexico City blasts out ash and clouds. And then finally the RSOE tonight. We got flooding in Nigeria, landslides in Uganda, um, the Katla, hailstorms in Uganda, and flash more, more uh, severe flash floodings in Pakistan. That's an ongoing situation. Uh, what can I say about BP and uh, the oil spill that is the Gulf of Mexico and the salt dome and how it's cracked and ruptured and, and, and it cannot hold this pressure back and uh, uh, we definitely have a lot going on, especially with Fukushima. So uh, enjoy what you can. Uh, please let me know if I missed anything and uh, I'll see you.